Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be discussing a useful topic if you're experiencing any problems with your Atom Mini Pro, how to do a hard reset, which is also called a factory reset. Before we get started with the process, let's discuss why you may need to reset your Atom Mini Pro. There are a few reasons why you might want to reset your Atom Mini Pro. If your Atom Mini Pro is acting weird, freezing, or not working properly, performing a hard reset, also known as a factory reset, can usually fix these problems. Another reason to reset your Atom Mini Pro is if you plan on selling or giving it away. Resetting it to factory settings will erase all of your personal information and settings. And lastly, perhaps you simply want to wipe the slate clean and start fresh by reconfiguring your Atom Mini Pro from scratch. Before we dive in, double check that you have all the necessary items on hand. Our Atom Mini Pro, power cable, USB cable, You'll need a computer with the Blackmagic Design software installed. You can find the download link in the video description below. All right, let's go through the process of resetting and updating your Atom Mini Pro. Step one, turn off your Atom Mini Pro by unplugging the power cable. Step two, find the mic one inch button on the top of your Atom Mini Pro and hold it down. Step three, while still holding down the mic one inch button, plug the power cable back in. You'll see the buttons on the Atom Mini Pro start flashing red. Step four, after the buttons start flashing red, plug in the USB cable from your Atom Mini Pro to your computer. Step five, open up the Blackmagic Design software on your computer. If you haven't installed it yet, you can find the download link in the video description. Step six, if there's a firmware update, the software will ask you to update it. Just follow the instructions on the screen to finish the update. Step seven, after the firmware update, the Atom Mini Pro may reset to factory settings on its own. If it doesn't, go to the file menu in the software and choose clear startup state to reset the device. Performing a hard reset will erase all your custom settings, macros, and presets. Make sure to back them up if you need them in the future. This process will also update the firmware to the latest version, which can boost performance and add new features. If you run into any problems while resetting, you can check out the Blackmagic Design Support website or reach out to their customer support for help. So that's it. You've just done a hard reset on your Atom Mini Pro. If you found this video useful, please hit the like button and drop a comment down below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button for more tutorials and tips on using your Atom Mini Pro and other video production gear. Thanks for tuning in.